that play go and move on to the next one. Kyle Murray's got to forget his last play as well. We talked to Vance Joseph about Marco Wilson. He said his tape screamed first round tape. And instead, they were really lucky to get him in the fourth round of the draft yeah. to steal. And it was interesting. Vance actually talked with his brother, Mickey Joseph, who's the wide receiver coach at LSU. And, and Vance said, hey, Mickey said, this guy that plays for Florida, he covered our wide receivers at LSU every time we played him. You might want to take a look at him. And uh, they don't know why he dropped. You remember he threw a shoe in the yes. LSU game last year? Lost that, the game. that temper came out in that game for sure. There's A.J. Green. Out to the 30, fifth at the five. Mm -hmm. I'll take that competitiveness and that fire. You can work with that and mold that over time as he matures, but he's got the talent you need. Yeah, he'll, he'll get over it. I mean, this, this is a kid who, look, he's one of the most skilled players on this team. He's going to be a tremendous pro, and he cares. And you know what? I think the Cardinals needed a wake-up call on their sideline anyway. I think they've been a little flat. They've had problems here at home. And an important third down here on third down and five. Cooper Cup runs. <laughs> you got James Conner out there running a return around the first down, third down. Going quick. AJ Green down the sideline. That's where they walk him out, pick up six. One of the best things I thought that Cliff Kingsbury told us was this. He flat out said, as Kyler goes, we go. If he's playing good, we have a shot. If not, it's not going to work. And tonight, you know, two interceptions, some bad decisions on his part. You see they're down 14 points. Connor will get a breather here for the first time. Eno Benjamin has checked in for Arizona now. He thought Benjamin was going to play a lot last week, and Connor was so good, couldn't get him out of the game. Second down and four. 